The planarian is a saltwater and freshwater flatworm known for its regenerative abilities. Cut off their tail and they'll grow it back. Cut them in half and they'll become two whole flatworms, even though they have a distinctive head region with a brain in it. What's really amazing is that even after losing its brain, a planarian can remember things from before it was beheaded. Planarians are pretty simple animals, but they do have brains that control things like sensory reception. It's hard to know what memories a planarian has, of course, but you can train them to perform new, unnatural behaviors and then see if they retain that memory under different conditions. When scientists have done this training regimen, they found planarians can retain memories for at least 14 days. That raises the question, of course, what happens when you cut off their heads? We know that within a week, the flatworms grow new, usable heads they can eat with and everything. But presumably, if you have a brain, that's where your memories are. So scientists have been trying to figure out what happens when the flatworms lose and then regrow their brains. And most strangely, they seem to remember previous training. In a 2013 study, for example, the trained flatworms approached the food faster, even though their training happened with their former heads. As for how they retain those memories, well, we don't really know. One intriguing idea is that memories of certain habitual behaviors are partially transferred to neural tissue outside the brain. So somehow, there are memories stored in other neurons in the body, which is just so completely against everything we thought we understood about memories. A lot more research is needed to figure out if it's unique to planarians or true of all brainy creatures. Because if human memories also exist outside of our brains in some way, understanding how could lead to better treatments for certain brain injuries, memory loss, or dementias.